Hello friends, I am Sanjay Gupta. In this tutorial, I am going to discuss about storage classes in C. Storage class defines four additional properties to each type of variables. These properties are default initial value, storage location, scope, and lifetime. So the default initial value means when we declare a variable, the compiler automatically initialize a particular value to this variable according to its storage class. Second is storage location. It means where uh, the uh, variable will occupy memory space so that it can store a particular value. Scope means in which block we can access value of a variable and lifetime means till when we can access value of a particular variable. So there are total four types of storage classes. First is automatic storage class. In this, uh, we use keyword auto. Second is register storage class. In this, we use keyword register. Third is static storage class. In this, we use keyword static. And fourth one is external storage class. In this, we use keyword extern. So this is the table, which is the combination of all four storage class along with their uh, four properties. So first discuss about uh, auto storage class. So in case of auto storage class, default value is garbage. Its storage location is RAM. Its scope is local to the block in which it is declared. Lifetime means till the control remains in the block. If the control of the program shifts to another block, then the value of automatic value, automatic variable automatically dies. Second one is register. Its default value is also garbage. Its storage location is CPU registers. Scope is local to the block in which it is declared and uh, lifetime is similar to the automatic storage class. Third one is static. In static, the default initial value is zero. Its storage location is RAM. Scope is local to the block in which it is declared. Uh, lifetime is different, value of static variable persists between different function calls. It means if we call a function twice, uh, so the output of the uh, first function call will be the input of second function call in case of static variable. Last one is extern. In case of extern, default value is 0, storage location is RAM and scope is global. It means uh, external variable can be accessible inside the whole program. Its lifetime is till the program comes to an end. It means if program is uh, uh, performing execution, then we can access a value of external variable anywhere in the program. So this is all about storage classes. Thank you.